You are not gonna believe the views from this boat dock on this $15 million property here on Lake Austin. Literally, you have the preserves across from you, views of gorgeous homes up on the cliffs, and such a private scenery. Today, what we're gonna be doing is going through some of the private listings on the off-market site. So we are gonna show you this and a handful of other homes starting from two million all the way up to this $15 million home. Most people don't know that there are private listing groups. I am a member on this list. You have to have a certain production level and you have to actually produce and have clients in this space. So this is how you get on groups like this. Now, there are a lot of reasons why people would wanna be on an exclusive off-market groups. Maybe they want their privacy. Maybe they wanna see what the price of the home they might get off-market. Maybe they just don't want a lot of people knowing they're selling their house. Whatever it is, there's lots of reasons people would wanna be on a private market like this. Let's show you some of the properties we're gonna to see today, and then we'll get back to this $15 million home at the end. Okay, so today what we're gonna do is go through the off-market properties, and a lot of them are high net worth individuals maybe, or just multi-million dollar homes. And so you have to be an agent part of these groups and have special access to these groups in order to actually see some of these homes. And so what we're doing is going through and showing you some of the homes that we get to look at as realtors and show you some of the open houses that maybe you wouldn't see on the MLS. Some of these are super private. So that's what we're doing today. I hope you enjoy the video. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and let's uh, go check out the first one on the list. Huh? Okay, we're at one of the first listings here. This is on High Road. Literally, we're one of the tallest points in the Westlake area. This house is gonna have tons of views. In a second, I'm gonna have Karen talk about this home a little bit. Now, you can buy this home and just keep this home as a home or basically tear down or add on to this lot. So we're gonna show you this house and the cool views in one second. Here we go. All right, we're here at 1402. Uh, high road with Karen Kelly, the listing agent. Okay, so this is listed just below one, uh, 2.1 million. Okay, so tell us a little bit about this lot. Obviously, we showed you high roads, amazing. The view of this house and the land is, I think, where it's totally worth 2.1. So tell me a little about this house and what's going on with the neighbors and what's, give, give me the lowdown. Okay, so we are right now at one of the highest points in Westlake. You have views for miles for like a 180 degree view. Uh, right here, you see Mount Benel, all of the canyon views, some downtown views. It's a little bit cloudy today, so you miss, uh, you can't really see downtown. But this is two thirds of an acre. Uh, my clients planned on being here long term. They have plans to go up a story, and uh, those downtown views are incredible. One of the most private and incredible views you'll see in Westlake. Awesome, so tell me, the next door neighbor bought that lot and now they're building and adding a level. Tell us a little bit about some of the things that other people are doing on the street. So there's lots of new construction on the street just because of the views. You get a big breeze up here too because you're at one of the highest points in Westlake. The neighbors bought that house in 2021 or that lot for uh, 2.375. They tore it down, they're building with four square builders and um, I think the views right here and the trees on this lot are actually a little bit better. So um, obviously we're, I think, priced correctly for the market. Well, too, I mean, look at the trees. You're not gonna be able to take these trees down and they are absolutely gorgeous trees. It's a really special lot for sure. I think it'd be really cool too. So you have a pool here, but if you had like an Affinity Edge pool right here, Affinity Edge pool looking into this, I mean, you're talking, what do you think this house will probably build out for and be, I, I don't 15 remember. Fifteen million. I mean, <laughs> well, it's a custom, so it's we don't custom, know. Right, it's a custom, right? It's a custom, right? But it, I mean, it's a huge house. Yeah. And um, yeah, it's big bucks. Yeah, I would imagine a house, thirty-five to uh, seven thousand square feet. If you put something out here with that view, pool, nice pool, custom, you're looking fifteen million plus. Maybe. 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 <laughs> maybe. All right. Well, there you go. Thanks for coming in and checking out this house. Thanks and, for coming in. And if you do have uh, questions, Karen is a listing agent on this particular property. Her info will be down below. We'll see you at the next property. Okay, we are now here in Terrytown. We're just a couple blocks away from Lake Austin, which is really amazing. I'm gonna give you some quick stats on this house and then I'm gonna show you some of the cool stuff. So number one, this is 
listed by Mark Moore with Gottsman Real Estate Group. So Mark's an amazing guy, I literally just spent 15 minutes talking to the guy, great guy. So this is a four bedroom, three and a half bath. What's cool about it is it's four living spaces. And there's two things that I absolutely love about this house that I wanna show you, so let's step inside. All right, step inside. So what you're gonna see when you first walk into this house is you have a living room, living space to this side, you have a living space to this side with the master bedroom over here and the kitchen this way. What's really nice is this stairwell down and this really, really cool chandelier. I'm a big fan of it. Walking through this house, there's so many nice little features that I like. We're gonna come look at the master bedroom in a second, but I wanna show you this living space over here. So you have this sunken in living space right here. You transition from the wood into concrete, into concrete tile, which is really nice. And then you have this really awesome fireplace that goes from this living space into that living space. You can see right through it, which is pretty amazing. And what's nice is this actually has uh, shades that come down. So you can hang out in this little patio out here, drop the shades down and make it nice and dark in here if you want. It's a really cool living space. I'm gonna teleport us into the kitchen. What's really impressive about this kitchen is that you have melee appliances in it. So pretty nice high-end appliances. I love the lighting that they've done in here. You got recessed lighting. You also have this really cool light bar. And you have a red island and white cabinets back here. Plus you have lots of natural light. And what's cool is, so you have a dining space over here. You have a breakfast nook over here. And what I like about it is what you get to look at down that way, which we're gonna see that in a second. Come on, let's keep going. All right, welcome back from the kitchen. There's so much to show in this house. I mean, it is a, what is it, over 4,000 square foot home, so it's huge. But you walk into this living space into the master bedroom right here. And what's nice is you have this big sliding door here. So imagine having a big, giant California, Texas, you know what? I think we should stop calling it California King and make it Texas King, okay? Who's in the comment sections agree with me there? Drop a comment. Okay, but you have a really nice patio out there. I don't wanna go out on the patio right now though because you'll see what I wanna show you in the backyard. So we'll hide that, but let's teleport into the master bath. I gotta get in it, okay? Shower head over here, shower head over here. Six foot man is gonna be very happy in this tub right here, or woman. Or woman, six foot woman. Oh wow, this is actually one of the deepest tubs I've been in, Bryce. This is cool, dude. I really like the closet here because you got lots of closet space, drawers, lots of fun stuff in here. Let's get out of the closet and go see downstairs. Hey, what are you doing up there? Down this way. Yep, down here, a little more. A little more, there you are. All right, you gotta come downstairs. And so what I like about this downstairs space that it has its own little like bar area, refrigerator area, and also to this side has a laundry room. And then you have one, two, three bedrooms, and then you have two full baths, which both look really, really nice. I wanna show you outside. I wanna show you that this level has access to outside. Check this out. You come outside and you have a hot tub right here, which is really nice. So what's cool is the floors down there are concrete floors. And then up here, you got beautiful oaks. But what's nice is you have kind of one of these plunge pools, if you will. So plunge pools are these smaller pools. They're usually gonna be a little bit deeper and or a little deep, right? And they're not super big. And so when you're looking at areas like this where every little inch on your lot matters, that's why something like this is really cool. So this house is listed at 3.5 million off market. Again, uh, Mark Moore is the listing agent on this particular property. We're gonna jump into the next property and we're going up the price point list. So the first one we showed you is about 2.1. This one is 3.5. The next one is gonna be in the $4 million range. Stay tuned and we'll see you at the next one. All right, now we're at a $4.2 million house in Rob Roy. This is a gated home in a gated community. And talk about one of the coolest walkways we've seen on the channel. This is 1.6 acres. It's a four bed, 
almost five bath, 4.5 bath, very nice size house, three car garage, and it's got sports courts, it's got a lot. This is listed by Dustin Lawless with Prospect Real Estate. This is a fantastic house. I cannot wait to show you one of the coolest things about this house. You gotta come see the view, come on. Okay, so when you step in the house right here, you have hallways going this way for bedrooms, you've got the garage over this direction, and you have the kitchen over here. But what a statement piece, right? When you step into your home, you have nothing but views. It's, it's kind of hard for me to like save that for the end of the video, which I'm gonna show you something really, really cool at the end of the video. But look at this, your fireplace in your living room look out. Imagine the lights come down, it's nighttime, you get sparkling downtown city views. Come on outside, let me show you. At night and during the day, you get downtown Austin views from this house. How incredible is that? You also get views of Lake Austin from here as well. And then you get views, there's actually, you can see the Barton Creek Golf Course right here. I'd say it's probably one of the best views we're gonna see. And look, you got barbecue out here. On all these properties, tell me, do you think that the, even though they're on the off market, right, do you think that they're priced well or not priced? You tell me. But look at this. This patio wraps around, and on this side, we have the kitchen over there. You have the master bedroom right over here. We're going to come back and see that in a second. You have what we have here, which is the kitchen. You have two dishwashers. You have an undermount microwave. Come over and check out the undermount microwave. Here we go. There you go, I'm gonna close that for you. And then right behind you, check this out. I mean, this oven is pretty much just like a work of art, I think. Got a flat top on here, that's pretty stellar. You have to take advantage of all of the views and take advantage, right, by having multiple seating areas. On the other wing, you have a bedroom that looks out that side, and then your living room, dining room. Now you have this viewing area the wraparound balcony comes this way into the master bath and bedroom. What's funny is I'm not even a bath guy. Are you a bath person, a shower person? You tell me, but golly, they got the crank out windows, which is nice. So you can crank the windows out. Do you think that this is staged or they're real furniture? You tell me in the comments as well, but holy moly, you know me, I love getting in people's bathtubs, but that's a good size bathtub, great size shower. This, this bathroom, back up Bryce, Gigantic, you can party in here. And look at this, the undermount lights are pretty spectacular. Look at this. This is pretty amazing. Pretty amazing. It does, I feel, I feel like in a department store, like you should have all your Prada right here, your Fendi. Let's go see what I think is one of the coolest things of this property. In fact, the thing I love most, let's go check it out. If you're expecting me to jump up and touch that rim, I can assure you the movie White Man Can't Jump was written about me. So look, I love the sports court. This is on 1.6 acres. This is fantastic. Look, they even got space over here for the dogs that are around. You could probably put your pool right there and then your three car garage is on that side. I love all of this. I mean, you tell me in the comment section. Now let's get to our next on the list. I know we've got a lot to show you today or we've showed you a lot, so thanks for hanging with us. Check out the most expensive on this list next. Here you go. Okay, we are here at one of the most exclusive streets in all of Austin, and we're at Michelle Turnquist of Engel & Volker's listing here. We're gonna go through this property. This is a $15 million property. We said that at the beginning of the video. This is the last on the list. This house is gigantic. It is, there's a lot of stuff I'm gonna tell you about this in a minute, but this house is expansive. The lot is expansive. There's a lot to see, so let's get in and see it. So we are in a $15 million home. This is the inside. Now, this is on Lake Austin, 278 feet of riverfront. You have this home with literally historic floors. These are 100-year-old wood floors right here. Or not 100-year-old, but 100-year-old oak floors. So 
beautiful floors, beautiful space. We're gonna show you more of the boat dock. There's a casita out there. You have two sides of this house, which is cool. So you came in from downstairs. This is the upstairs. You have rooms that way and then a breezeway under you right here and then another grand room on this side. So there's so much in this house is pretty amazing. This whole lot sits on about four acres. So what they have for sale right now is a 15 million for four acres. You can buy the full seven acres. As I'm talking to you, I'm showing you the upstairs master bathroom. Look at this tub. I don't even know, should I even get in this tub? You tell me in the comment section, should I, you don't even need to say it, I'm getting in the tub. It's interesting about this house is you do have some very exclusive people in this area. Now, if you wanna reach out and get more information about this home or some of the other homes, definitely reach out. I will put some of the listing agents information below in the description just so you can reach out to them directly if you wanna do that as well. But again, these homes are not on the MLS. In fact, some of these will go on the MLS, some of them won't, some of them will sell off market, but that's, that's what's nice about this exclusive listing, right? You tell me, $15 million home, you've seen the downstairs, the upstairs, you tell me what you think so far. This is the cabana of this home. So what's really cool is that the cabana can be its own house, really. So this is a downstairs of the cabana, you got your kitchen here. You kind of go in and out to the pool. So if you're gonna like have guests or parties here, you could do all your cooking and everything here and then just make this cool breezeway in and out of the pool and then in and out of the lake. That's crazy. I, I really like this. I mean, what do you think? So when you've boated along Lake Austin, you've probably seen these beautiful homes as you've gone through and gone by Lake Austin, never wondered who has lived on this or who owns this. So this is one of those private docks that you, that you have along this river. Now the preserve over here is a preserve. You're not gonna have anybody building across from you when you buy a home like this. Along the stretch of the lake and most of the lake, you have a lot of people who want to be private and they're sometimes high profile names. So when you buy a home like this, you may have a high profile neighbor that you didn't know. I was literally driving through with the camera guy here in this video and we went and I saw Tony Gonzalez, tight end, just walking his dog on the street. So some of the cool things that you see when you drive through some of these private, more exclusive neighborhoods in the Austin area. What's pretty interesting to know, if, if you had a boat dock on Lake Austin and just rented out the boat dock or sold the boat dock. I've seen boat docks on Lake Austin sell for multi-million dollars to be just, ha just have a boat dock. So you have the pool, the main house, and then the cabana. You can actually just rent out the cabana on Airbnb if you wanted to and let people play here on the dock. And that's pretty amazing to me. All right, let's go see the rest of the house, come on. It's really, really hard to encapsulate such a big property and really do a, in just a short amount of time, do justice of a property like this. So I apologize if we're not showing all the intricate details of this house. Maybe I'll talk with Michelle and do a full video and come back and do a full property tour of this house because I think it's, it's worth it. If you want me to come do full videos on this channel about properties like this or maybe more of the off-market properties, drop a comment below. If you enjoy videos like this, drop a comment below. We will catch you in the next video. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. We'll see ya.